Hello everyone, my name is Azatru, how are you? And welcome to another Star Wars Battlefront 2 video of mine. And we finally got the community transmission for General Grievous with a brand new image of him and more. So I'm going to be breaking down all of his abilities, appearances, his emotes, all good kinds of good stuff. But I'll first show you this image and it is absolutely beautiful. So it's him on Geonosis. And it's not just that, but we do have Geonosian battle droids. So, so if you remember a few videos back, I made a video saying we need droid skins, including the Geonosis battle droid. And well, that seems to be what's coming. Plus, we do have our first proper look at Geonosis in the game. And just the feeling of it looks awesome. We have a droid command ship on the floor, it seems. Just what you'd expect from Geonosis. But now let's move on to the droid commander himself. So the community transmission details to start off with the challenges they face, such as how hard it was to animate General Grievous, among other things. And let's just talk about his abilities first. So he has Thrust Surge, Claw Rush, and Unrelenting Advance. So Thrust Surge is when General Grievous focuses on a target in front of him and rushes towards them whilst doing a stab motion with all four of his lightsabers. Then, his Claw Rush ability allows him to go down on all six limbs, rush forward, damaging and pushing away enemies in his path. Now, that is going to be very interesting to see. And Unrelenting Advance is where Grievous will spin two lightsabers over his head and advance on his enemies. Whilst this is active, Grievous blocks any frontal attacks and damages enemies in front of him. So, Grievous will use two lightsabers as his primary attack, which is what we expected, but most of his abilities do use those four lightsabers, which is pretty cool. So, he has a bunch of new star cards, such as Beating Heart, which increases the health regeneration. Then we have Cyborg Rage, where health is regained upon each kill of a troop or hero. Then we have Sif Trained, which increases the damage and stamina drain. Then we have Jedi Killer, which increases his reach. Momentum, which increases his damage. Cowardly Retreats, this is damage reduction. Lineup Weaklings is increased damage. Ceaseless Assault increases the active time of Unrelenting Advance. And Deadly Slashes increases the damage of Unrelenting Advance. So here is a selection of his voice lines. We saw a bunch of these a few days ago. But of course, if you want to see even more, then there you go. It's really cool, I must say. And I cannot wait to hear some of those in Battlefront 2. Now, as for victory poses, we have four new victory poses. It's Lines of Death, Jedi Hunt, Doom, and Consider Yourself Crushed. As for emotes, there is You Are a Bold One, Crush Them, Surrender, and Your Screams are Music to My Audio Receptors. I'm very excited to be using those on Battlefront. So, appearances. Let's talk about the skins for General Grievous. Well, the default appearance is just Jedi Hunter. And this is what you typically see of General Grievous, just straight up playing General Grievous. However, there will be a battle damage skin at his launch on October 30th, which will cost 20,000 credits or 500 crystals. And this is when you're definitely different and you can definitely see he has been battle damaged. They also noted the milestones that are coming and you can see those on screen right now. Pretty simple and it's another way to earn more credits. So there we have it. General Grievous is coming on October 30th. That is your deep dive for everything we need to know about General Grievous. We'll be getting more details on everything coming in the few in the next few days, coming in the next update. And I'm really excited to play as a brand new hero in Battlefront 2, especially the Droid Commander. Let me know in the comment section below your thoughts on General Grievous. Are you excited? What ability do you want to use first? And just give me your general thoughts. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like and check out any of the two previous videos on screen if you'd have missed them. But I'll see you all in my next Star Wars Battlefront 2 video. Goodbye.